All right. I saw this is the Amboy Amboy yeah, Amboy Crater. Might as well stop and take a look. That must be it right there. Another ancient volcano. We'll find out. Looks interesting. All right, this is Rig Dog coming to you from the Amboy Crater. Amboy Crater. Seen it on the map. This is the first time I've ever been out here. Made a little stop. See them behind me there. They got some facilities, some picnic tables, some awning set up. They got this little lookout point. Got an outhouse back there. And uh, funny thing about the outhouse, I was watching uh, Lewis and Matt Tramping. Look them up on YouTube, Lewis and Matt Tramping. They're from New Zealand. And uh, <laughs> they mentioned something in one of their videos about a long drop. A long drop? What the heck's a long drop? Well, I know what a long drop is now. I guess that's what they call an outhouse in New Zealand. A long drop. You know. <laughs> so uh, I just went back there and used the uh, facilities. And yeah, it is a long drop. But uh, it's pretty interesting. This is one big lava field here. And uh, I imagine that that is the Amboy Crater. Uh, ancient volcano. And all this is lava. I guess the Park Service put a little hiking trail out here, which is good. So I'm gonna hike a trail as far as I can go. Uh, the sun is warm. The air's a little cool, but the sun is really, really warm. And I'm wearing a black shirt, or I was wearing a black shirt. That made it really, really hot. So I didn't want to get my black shirt all sweaty anyway, because I got to meet some people later on today uh, down by the river, down by the Colorado River. So. Hang in there, and if I see anything interesting, I'll stop and point it out to you. But this is pretty much what it looks like. Okay, one thing I'd like to recommend to anybody, everybody, you know, if you're going to wander away from your vehicle, uh, make sure you take water with you, just in case. You know, um, I've wandered away a couple times just to take some pictures and I end up hiking out further than I anticipated, than I originally planned because I just saw something, I uh, let's go over that next hill. And uh, I didn't take any water with me. I had camera, binoculars, and all kinds of stuff, but uh, no water, you know. Not a oh wait, all right. all right, I'm making my way around the crater. So it's right behind me here. Pretty steep. A lot of rocks. So they say there's a breach in the crater somewhere around the back side here. So I'll go around the back side and see what it looks like. The uh, trail takes a little fork in the road. One goes that way, and one goes up top of this ridge. I'm gonna go see if I can go up the ridge, follow the ridge and maybe come on back down and back out or maybe head down the other side. See what it looks like. Oh, there we are right there. The red truck, the white truck in the loo. We needed some. Wow, look at the dry lake over there. Yeah, 
Sure. My left boot's cutting in my ankle for some reason. Shoot. All right. I'm up here on the ridge of the crater here. So if you ever want to look down in the volcano, I know I always wanted to see what was down there. That's what's down there. So here's my route. I started up there, hit the ridge, followed the ridge up, stopped, took a break there, ate a can of tuna and some crackers. Ritz crackers and starfish tuna. Or the chicken of the sea. Anyway, followed the ridge back around and uh, heading back down to the crater now. Walking, walking, still walking. Well, I'm back. As you can see, there's only three cars here, but it is a Friday. The place is very nice and clean. No graffiti, no trash. That pristine parking lot. Let's keep it that way. Got this cool little top on this table over here restrooms are clean what more could you want well this is root dog signing out from Amboy crater California we're gonna be moving on to the uh, Colorado River next peace out